Now I will be going through the steps to create a new virtual machine instance. and press enter and I can select it okay so in this first screen I will select uh, try or install Ubuntu let's start with install Ubuntu so you can choose the keyboard layout of uh, you like I will select the Turkish keyboard for myself. Um, here I uncheck this option. Also, I also recommend you don't connect to internet while installing Ubuntu on your machine because sometimes it might um, cause it to bug out. I also choose to install third party things. Okay, so I always select something else here because I like to partition my drive myself. First, it's always better to assign some EFI system partition about 100 megabytes. And the next one would be the X4, which would be the root, which is 20 megabytes less and the last rest of the 20 megabytes uh, sorry 20 gigabytes would be the uh, swap area okay so you the um, some of your uh, RAM memory and swap memory should be about 64 gigabytes so just keep this in mind it, it's for the um, fastest compilation times for autoware and I will just go with it for now. Continue. Okay, ESPX for swap. It's fine. And I will pick my location. Clocks to show well. I will call this Autoware. I will also name it Autoware 2. Just random passwords for this. I will put here ASD. Um, yeah, I think this should be fine. All right, now it's finished installing it. Now I will restart it. Um, press so you can remove your USB drive. Uh, so this restarts the machine. Mm, I should have probably really plugged off the um, this drive. Oh, okay. We have everything set up. So um, I generally skip these online accounts things I also skipped the live patch I also don't send information I don't open the location services and done right now um, so first thing to do is generally uh, I will press Control alt and T to open the terminal so you can also open it from here so also before opening the terminal, let's do um, software, uh, which one was it? I think this one, software and updates. So here uh, I generally pick the main server instead of the local place, uh, because sometimes they can cause some issues. Um, sorry. Okay, never mind. For the other software, we don't need to do anything on these. Um, here, make sure this is subscribed to all updates. And I generally don't check automatic updates. I don't install these ones, but these are up to you. This is so that I don't get annoyed by these things. Um, for um, so 
you can choose to install the um, drivers here too but for this one I will not touch these things because I will fix the resolution soon and I don't touch any of these other settings too I'll just close and reload so it is doing something equivalent to um, so the apt update um, once this is finished we can go to the terminal the sudo apt update and we have packages to be upgraded so let's upgrade them so I need to do sudo um, sudo apt dip dist upgrade and I will say yes to everything here so we will wait for these to finish now so first the apt update will update the um, the remote repository um, information and what can be updated upgraded and sudo apt this upgrade will um, upgrade all of our packages now we wait All right, now the upgrade operation has finished. So let's check one more time. This is the apt update, and uh, everything's up to date now. This is what we want to see. Now, one thing I need to do just because this is a virtual machine is to install VirtualBox guest editions. And for that, we go to devices and insert guest edition CD image, and then we download it. Then we hit download again. Now that it's downloaded, we can insert the disk. Now let's open a terminal inside the disk folder. And now I will run the VirtualBox Linux editions.run file. This will let the guest OS play well with the virtual box and support features like shared clipboards and resizing it from outside. Now that this is installed, I will restart the virtual machine instance. Now as I resize the window of the virtual box, the guest resolution is also changing adaptively. And this concludes our Ubuntu installation and system setup process.